Brian. Brian! Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about. Whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a great week, folks. Create the perfect relationship between you and your body. Treat your body with all love, honor, gratitude, and respect. When you make it a goal to adore your body and accept yourself completely, you'll learn to have the perfect relationship with anyone else you are with. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials trading down 54, NASDAQ's up 22, SP's up 4. Gold, gold contract down four, up $4.40, traded at 2029 an ounce. We have silver down 12 cents, $25.80 an ounce. Light sweet crude up a buck seventy-seven, $73.11 a barrel. Notes and bonds. The 10 year note trading down 16 ticks at 115.07. The 30 year down a full point plus two ticks at 129.29. And King Dollar. King Dollar up 160 ticks, trading 101.374. The euro is at 110, the yen is at 135, and the British pound is at 126 to 1 US dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world and the world of the S&Ps. Let's take a look at it. What do we have? Well, let me bring up the SPY first. So you had a big day on Friday. That being said, the bottom line is that, you know, you still are not at the highs. Uh, Friday, what we did do is that you had the price spread, but you didn't get the expansion of volume. So this is going to get really intriguing in here because what we did is that we did the 87 million shares, and that 87 million is actually going against a, a good, what is that, 101 million. It's going to be a toss-up here. That's the real bottom line. What we have out here today, you get light volume out here today. You get a sideways move out here today, too, though. Right now, we have only done 38 million shares. And the, well, uh, now, let's take a look at the future. I brought this up when I was just doing the update. Now, this is really cool because you don't, you don't, you don't see something come back just this fast. We'll see how this shakes out. But what we do have is this. Now you get a high-volume low that's laying out here like a monster, 41.37. We came down 17 S&P points in about a hot, yeah, literally a hot, yeah, like 30 seconds. Now, it, took, it only took 20 minutes to get all the way back topside. Bottom line, you got back topside. Now you're under the high. So the probability is once we get under this high, we're right, we're, let's see, the, the top of that range was right where we are now, 41.54. If we, let's say you get to 41.52.50, bottom line, the probability goes up dramatically. You're going to go after that high, and there's plenty of time to, I mean, that high volume low, and there's plenty of time to go after that high volume low before we close today. NQs. We take a look at the NQs out here. Same type of setup inside the NQs. Did the same thing. Just came out of nowhere. Boom. It's something to keep your head wrapped around also, folks, okay? The move and the NQs as well as the S&P. Now, the NQs haven't got back inside that bar yet. But when you get moves like that, that's an indication that we still have a bear that's happening out here. Because what happens is this, is that when you get moves that come out of nowhere and go down, that's a bear. When you get moves that come out of nowhere and go up, you get, you're get inside a bull. That's how it works. That's just, that's, that's just how it is. So that move right there, you know, I'm sure that the computer's got hold of something, meaning out in the web, and then they decide that, up. Oh, that's right, we're wrong about this one, but guess what? That high volume blow is going to get tested. Gold, we look at the gold market out here. We have with gold, gold's in an ABC structure up. You know, took out the B point, took it out with volume. Now you get a complex one because we came under the B point again. Bottom line, gold's going to continue higher. And now this is where it gets dicey because, well, first let me go to the 10-year. Because the 10-year, the Fed might, you know, well, the Fed has been going up. But the 10-year, you can see we made, it, we made it to the top of the range. And the 10-year is looking like an ABC structure on the way up. Because what we did have is this, is that you can see on Friday, you back down with 1.2 million. Today, you're only backing down with 827,000. And then we hit a high with 1 you know, 2.1 million contracts. So you're coming into those highs with 2.1 million contracts. 
That is saying higher price, lower yield. And then we go over to the gold contract, I mean the uh, dollar, and this is the tricky one for sure. The dollar, you know, has been at these lows for quite some time now. And it's keep, it keeps rejecting price, keeps rejecting lower price. And, you know, like when you look at it slightly, it's like, okay, you know, we do have higher lows, but just barely. <laughs> um, so we'll see where this shakes out. We're, we, we're at 101.372 right now. We went to 101.041, and hey, we'll see how it shakes out, man. Uh, the danger is going to be in, you know, breaking out those lows, you know. So we'll see how it shakes out. Some of the higher volume equities out here today, and today's not going to be a high volume day at all. You have uh, Tesla is up a, a buck. We have Advanced Micro up five and a half dollars. You got Kavana that's moving out here. It's pretty wild. It's up two and a half dollars. NVIDIA is up uh, $4.50. Let's go look at NVIDIA. Tyson Foods is down $10. I guess we need, I'm not eating chicken anymore. NVDA. Let's go take a look at NVDA for a second here. Okay, so that's at another high. Tyson. We go to Tyson. See what happened here. This thing is dropping 10 bucks. That dropped out of bed. Oh, this has been dropping out of bed for quite some time. This is, you're talking about from, this stock has got cut in half. They got something wrong with this stock. Look at that. Look, oh, my God. So this is going after high volume. If you want to see high volume lows, how they go after them, this is amazing, man. Every time I see this, folks, it blows my mind, even though, you know, now I'm going on like almost 25 years since I wrote my first book. But these high volume lows, man, they go after them. And you can see, you know, we're only, it's at 42. It's $8 away from it now. And this is an equity that, that you had the consolidation. It got all the way up to, after the high volume low, it got all the way up to 100 bucks, and the high volume low is 42 How about that? Now, that's insane. No doubt. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Dow, Dow's down 62. NASDAQ's up 14. S&Ps are up one and a half. Stay right there, folks. We'll come right back.